jina langu naitwa Agnes Rehema Chisiwa mimi ni mkulima ni mkaaji hapa Junju Ward leo nimefurahi kutembelewa na nyinyi wageni kutoka kwa FAO Her smile leaves no doubt of her pride Agnes is a chairperson of the Juhudi Farmer Field School in Kilifi South Kenya She's a visionary entrepreneur and a dedicated farmer trainer who enjoys sharing her knowledge with the local farmers. Agnes trains women and men on agricultural business development. At the same time, she also prepares them to overcome local traditions and customs that hinder women like herself from progressing. Wa mama ni kama wanabeba mzigo wote wa jamii. Kuanzia ile time ameamka mpaka kufikia saa ya kulala tena. Mama amefanya vitu vingi kabisa. Until a few years ago, Agnes had difficult to discuss openly with her husband about money matters and they never consulted with each other in making decisions. This happens in many families. Things started to change in 2020 when Agnes was trained on the women's empowerment farmer business and an innovative approach that promotes participatory decision making and applies gender lens to business skills development in family farming. She was among the 100 facilitators from Kilifi County who participated in the WFBS training organized by FAO in partnership with the county government of Kilifi. Banangu alikuwa akija akipata pesa. Tulikuwa hatuongei. Yeye amepata zake na mimi nimepata zangu. Kama ni unga nitanunua mimi unga na yeye siku hiyo amekuja kutoka huko kazini amenunua unga na yeye. Sasa tuko siku nyingine hata tutataka kula sima peke yake hakuna mboga. Basi mimi huku nitanunua unga. Kwa hivyo kama waja wewe nunua mboga. Kama ni school uniform mimi nimenunua shati huku. Usije na shati ya Josephu eh. Nunua suruwale. Basi sasa hii mambo ni mazuri kabisa ile mafunzo wametusaidia mpaka hata mimi nafurahia. Ole mradi tulifundishwa kule mambo ya gender. Tukafundishwa mambo ya visioning, visioning journey tukafundishwa mambo ya marketing tukafundishwa kuform hizo committees za market survey group dynamics tukafundishwa mambo mengi tena kabla tu produce ndio utapetape soko sasa saa hii hatu, hatu produce kama vile mwanzo eti tunaenda tunatengeneza mizigo hatujui tutauzia nani ule mradi ulitufungua macho kabisa saa hii Tunaenda kwa market survey. Tunaangalia products zenye ziko kule na tunaangalia wale wauzaji wa wenye wako kule kwa soko. Ni nini kizuri mngependa kununua kutoka kwa wakulima na kwa wakati gani kuna bei gani? Kwa, kwa mfano sasa hivi nyanya. Nyanya tunawauliza mngependa nyanya aina gani? Variety gani? Na mngependa zikiwa kubwa ama zikiwa ndogo? na mnachukua kiasi gani tunataka tujue ndio sisi sasa tukija huku tunajua wakati ule wa tomato hakuna ni kidogo kule sokoni na sisi kama wakulima wenye tunafanya unyunyizaji basi tunazalisha wakati huo na tukua tunawa target wale wanunuzi wow i remember agnes very well i was one of her trainers in 2020 Listening to her words really makes me proud because I see how knowledgeable she has become. She is also very charismatic, don't you think? My name is Queen Katembo and I coordinate the WFPS activities in FAO Kenya. Thanks to funding from Flexible Mount Partner Mechanism, we are helping transform the lives of rural women farmers and their families. In partnership with World Vision International, the SAP program trained 15 master trainers, built the capacities of 257 farmer facilitators who have in turn transferred the WFBS skills to 2,678 farmers. We expect to have reached 5,200 female and 1,300 male farmers with these skills by the end of 2022. Our representative in FAO Kenya can tell you more about the sub program over to you madam kala thank you queen i am happy to see how the life of agnes and others are changing for the better by involving both men and women 
the WEFBS approaches give space for unpacking gender norms while strengthening entrepreneurial skills and the capacity to improve their farm business activities, engage in lucrative value chains, and pursue market opportunities. Thanks to FMM funds, our efforts are transforming women's lives by strengthening their capacity to do farming as a business, to network, develop a vision plan for their families, and define concrete steps for achieving it. We are also sharing our lessons and experiences on the WFBS with other countries such as Cambodia, Senegal, and Uganda. I a target plan. I have a vision journey. 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 I Na hiyo vision ingjani yangu basi naona hivyo isha anza pole pole. Na save nikiwa niko na matumaini ya kupata kile kitu. Kwa sababu pale mwanzo nukua nasema na ika kwenye kibengi. Mara hivyo isha kibrugu chataari na chukua na afunja na chukueza pesa. Lakini mafunzo ya menisaidia. Muzika